Hey guys, Mechanic CG here and welcome back to another episode of Tourist Trophy. Today is episode number 11. If you guys do want to stay up to date with the rest of the Tourist Trophy series, then make sure to subscribe and hit that notification bell. And make sure to check out the links in the description for our socials. We've got Instagram, Discord and Twitter. But hopefully you guys do enjoy today's video. We have defeated the Laguna Seca once again. And there is a Suzuki GSX 1400. Awesome. We have shown the track who's boss. And that is us. And we win. I definitely did not like driving around that track though with that bike. Uh, next up. Ooh. I like that silver. I'm going to take this one. And this is around the special stage route 5. A very, very nice track. So uh, let's go. And we're off. Oh, we got slowed down quick. I forgot that uh, the first corner is pretty soon after the... Um, or the breaking zone for the first corner is pretty soon after the uh, start-finish line. Which is different in Gran Turismo 4. Because uh, you can break quite a bit later. Sort of into the corner, actually, with most cars. we go decent let's get around there get around whoa you need to watch out for those inside corners because uh, you can hit your head on there and that is instant failure instant disqualification come on nice Awesome. Right, hopefully we did catch up through that last section. I think we may have lost a bit of time. Ooh. Careful, careful, careful. Okay, there we go. We're back. We did actually gain one second, so I'm actually surprised about that. Flat out, let's go. Nice. Where's the braking zone? I'll probably say here. Ah, oh, going around that corner is so smooth. This bike is so smooth. I'm not even joking. This is insane. Awesome. We are catching up. Let's see if we can get him on the... Oh, oh, oh. Careful. I was going to go for it, but uh, I was worried that that drop was going to cause us to fall off the bike. So, slow it down a little bit. Make sure we safely get around at least. Oh. Don't fall, please, because I'll get disqualified. I think we can definitely catch them up on the main straight, or even now. Or we might get overtaken. Nope. No, we don't. Oh, look, and we fell off. Amazing. 3 minutes, 12.678. Awesome. And we got to save that replay for thumbnails. Ta-da! We got the Suzuki GSX 1300R Hayabusa, I think. I think that's what it's called. But uh, yeah, I probably butchered that completely. But we're going to go and pick our next bike now, which is the GSX R1000. These are... These are getting to the amazing bikes. These are getting to really good ones. Uh, I fancy a yellow Suzuki. So we're going to go for this one around Deep Forest. Right, so we're going against the Ducati um, 
triple nine R, which has so much less horsepower than this thing. So I don't see how this is going to be a fair fight. Uh, use the rear brakes through here to keep it flowing, but keep it moving very fast still. Don't want to scrub off too much speed in these corners. Oh, pretty much a corner cut there. Nobody has to know. Awesome. Slow down. Get around here. Perfect. Wheelie. I'm having a wheelie good time. Haha, <laughs> funny. Nice. Right, slow down hard on the brakes now. Perfect. That is good. Right, how far ahead is the other bike? Five seconds? Four seconds? Right, slow down now. We've got some airtime there as well, which is pretty impressive actually for a bike. Right, rear brakes are on, rear brakes are on. Perfect. Three seconds behind now. I need more time. I need to gain more time. I'm sort of getting the hang of this as well, because um, I remember Deep Forest Raceway when I tried this on the bike for the license was so difficult for me. I had to cut out so many attempts. And yeah, here we are now, flying through these, this track. With no problems whatsoever. 237, first attempt. Very nice. And there we go, the Suzuki GSX R1000. Another bike unlocked. Very nice. It's bright yellow. It looks like a bumblebee. Could be part of Transformers, actually. I've never watched Transformers. Don't at me in the comments. Uh, next up is the Suzuki GSX R400 Racing Modify. This is a uh, oh Twin Ring Mategi East Short Course. Okay, this is the good track. Twin Ring Mategi is an amazing track. Let's go. And here we go. Twin Ring Mategi on our modified superbike. Where's the braking zone? Here we go. Very good. Nice. We've got some good first corners here. Oh, careful. I think this is actually the last of the um, sort of what is it? Junior? Before we move on to the experts. And then we've got three experts and then one super. Awesome. Careful. Stay on track. Ah, oh, that slide though. That slide was unbelievable. Go, 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 go. Nice. Let's get around the hairpin corner. We are catching up. I don't know how many laps we've got left, though. If it's two or three laps. Because it might be two laps. 
It's three laps, I think. We'll find out in a minute. If we don't overtake him, then... And it says fail, then uh, obviously we got it wrong. What the heck? I thought we were about to fail that then, big time. Apparently not. We got away with that. Look at the shadows though in this game. It is insane. The shadows have been amazingly rendered in. Look how narrow these tyres are. I didn't actually notice that, but look, jeez. Those are some narrow tyres. Those are some thin AF treads. Okay, here we go, here we go, we're catching up. This is the make or break moment when we find out if it's two laps or three laps. Tell me it's three, tell me it's, oh, actually we might, because if we cross the line ahead, it still passes. Three laps. There we go. Three minutes, 17.541. Very good. Awesome. GG's. And here we go. The Suzuki GSX R 400 Racing Modified. It's actually a concept by Taurus Trophy, which is uh, very interesting. And we're about to ruin the bike with... Load. The number 69. There we go. <laughs> Brilliant. Just like the build up to what number we're going to pick and it's just always 69. But anyways, next up is the Suzuki RG500 Gamma Racing Modify. Uh, so I'm looking forward to this one. And it's round the autumn ring. We've only got one lap though, so we got to be quick. Right, here we go. Two bikes. We have to overtake before the finish, and this one is actually pretty quick. This racing modify. The fact is, as well, there isn't any like overly insanely fast bikes that are just OP. Or if there is, I haven't found it yet. Go, go, go. Nice. Awesome. See if we can overtake this next one. This is going to be the shortest challenge yet of like today. Come on, move out of the way. We're in the lead, we're in the lead, we're in the lead, we're in the lead. About to get overtaken. And there we go, we won. Ta da, jazz hands. Awesome. That was decent. I will take that. And here we go. The RG500 Gamma Racing Modify. Let's go. Let's put a number on it. And let's take the bike. Thank you. Thank you for the gift, Taurus Trophy. Next up is the GSX R600 Racing Modify. Let's go. Oh, and this is Suzuka. This is going to be fun. Right, here we go. The fat tires of this Suzuki are going to try and get us around the Suzuka circuit. Oh, nearly lost it there. That was close. Oh, please don't fall over, I beg. Awesome. Got 
one more bike to overtake. And this could be quick, actually, for us. Nice. Oh. That was close to being disqualified. Easily. Right, need to watch out here. Because remember, this track has a little cutout. A little added section for uh, the bikes only. Here we go. There it is. Now we've done it, we don't have to worry about it again because we're going to overtake it. And there we go. We got the win. Nearly got overtaken at the end then, but still got the win. Ta-da. And here we go. The Suzuki GSX R600 Racing Modify 05. I think I forgot to save that replay. Bugger. I might have. I'm not sure. Because I'm saving every other replay. So, rip me. That was really good. I enjoyed that bike. Yes, I forgot to save it. Urgh, bugger. Right, Suzuki GSX 1400 Racing Modifier is next. Let's do it. And we're around the new... the uh, can't speak. The Fuji Speedway 90s track for two laps. Let's do it. Right, here we go. I can predict this is going to take quite a few attempts. I'm uh, definitely going to take at least two laps to overtake all of them. Fuji Speedway is not my cup of tea. Awesome. Brilliant. Oh, a little bit off-road. Managed to keep it on, though. Decent. Nice. Oh, careful. That was a rubbish corner there. See if we can catch back up. Nice, nice, nice. Come on. Once we've done with all these bikes, done all the challenge mode, we can then move on to... Uh, what is it? The actual races. Once we've done the race events, that'll be the game 100%ed. And then... I am thinking of doing... Maybe... Gran Turismo 4. Not confirmed yet. That may not be until next year. But uh, I am thinking of playing that game. So we'll see how it all goes. Because I think I might play that. Because it is a big game, of course. So gives me a chance to just relax with the game. Like a decent game. And have like a long project series would be amazing. We do need to hurry up, though, because I do need to catch this bike. As long as we overtake him and cross the finish line in first, it should still count. Eight, seven. Are we going to get it before the finish line? Looks like we are. Amazing. 313.263. That took 
so much longer than I was expecting. So much longer. And there we go. We have the Suzuki GSX 1400. Let's get our number put on there. Very nice. 69. Haha. <laughs> awesome. Right. Final bike. And this is probably going to be one of those time challenges around the track for 1 minute 44 again. The Suzuki GSX R1000 Racing Modify. And it is one lap finished within 144 to win the motorcycle. Now, I like the look of this one. So I'm looking forward to getting it. And here we go. Panning across in front of the bike. Let's see if we can get this first try. Oh, very shaky through there. Oh, come on, get around there. Perfect. wobbly and very sketchy through there. I did not like that one bit. Awesome. Perfect. Tucked it back down again. I think the target to aim for with this track is to hit that final corner and have exited it by... Uh, 1 minute 36. 32. 33. 34. 35. 36. We're on a good streak. Ah! 0.3 seconds off. Okay. Fair enough. For a first try, being 0.3 seconds off, I feel like if we were less wobbly and a little less cautious, um, we might get it this time. Very good. Much better exit. Instantly, I think we've gained most of that time back from the first two corners. Yeah, look at that. The second corner was perfect. We've gained so much time back now. Getting these lines perfect this time. Wow. I still think Gran Turismo with bikes is just such a great idea. And the fact that Taurus Trophy, look at that, 1.1 seconds ahead. Doing amazing. I really do think that they need to make a Taurus Trophy too. They can make so much out of it. Because they could, after making Forza... Uh, not Forza. After making Gran Turismo 7, if they copy and paste that like they did with the um, Taurus Trophy for Gran Turismo 4, copy and paste that exactly the same format. Like, they could even save themselves more time by not even changing anything. Having up bikes that you have to buy, upgrades, all that stuff. Problem solved. Look at that though. Look at the time exiting that corner. 1 minute 43.3. One second below. Awesome. And there we have it. The Suzuki GSX R1000 Racing Modify is now ours. But as well as that, we have now completed every single Suzuki vehicle challenge, Suzuki bike challenge. So we now own 
all 15 Suzuki bikes. Obviously, one of them we didn't have to challenge because we got it for free. We've also done all of the Kawasaki. We've also done all of the Honda. So next up is Yamaha, BMW, Triumph, all of that. I think we could do the Yamaha in one go. And then I think all of these will probably be in one video. Because there's not many of these bikes. Or they'll be in two videos. But there isn't enough to spill it out into separate videos. But yeah. Awesome. So thank you guys so much for watching. If you did enjoy, be sure to leave a like, comment down below, and subscribe. If you want to help support the channel, then make sure to hit that join button or hit that merch link in the description. And don't forget to check out the description for our social links. We have Instagram, Discord, and Twitter. But thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you in the next one. Goodbye. Like a Christmas